All right, hey, what is up, everybody? All right, so we just got confirmation about what's going to be in DLC Pack 2 and what free DLC players are going to have. Now, it's a little unnerving to know that free DLC players won't be getting any free character content, um, but you guys are going to be getting five costumes, three accessories, five new attacks, five new uh, BGMs for the Countdown City music, and then I guess they're having an additional um, rule. I'm not sure. It's, it says an additional Tenkaichi Budokai rule. And then you're going to get a Tenkaichi Budokai outfit. Now, you'll see everything on the scan here in a sec. It, excuse me for not being in English. I have the, the Japanese one from V-Jump. But I'm just translating from what I'm seeing right here on a separate um, computer. Now... I know it's going to be a little unnerving for people who really did want, you know, Goku, Black, Zamasu, Super Saiyan Blue, Vegito, and I guess it makes sense the way they're doing it. I mean, in my personal thoughts, I thought that Super Saiyan Blue, Vegito, and all of them would come, but they're doing it this way, and I don't know, there's not really much that they could give for free, unless they decided to go with bringing Botamo and um, Magetta into this for free. That's still a possibility. I don't know because in my thoughts, Magetta's a giant character, maybe a little bit bigger than Broly. So I don't know how they would go about doing that. And Botamo, you know, he's the same. So I don't, I don't know because you know they are trying to still give free content to the players so it's still a possibility that you guys could be getting that but I highly doubt it because those are two new characters and I mean it would be cool if they did give new characters that really just you know weren't really that good to free DLC players because it makes sense to do it that way and not just leave free DLC players in the dust but I guess this is what they're doing for their free update and what we can expect from it now two main things that I wanted to look at is the two attacks right there so you see Vado's doing some sort of what I want to say like a spirit bomb like supernova kind of thing in her own version and the question is is this her actual ultimate is this a super attack cutscene ultimate I don't know and that goes for Champa as well because that looks like it could be a cutscene ultimate or a very basic ultimate at that because it looks like from what I'm looking at it looks like five key blasts or yeah five little key blast or five big key blasts that might explode in your vicinity or track you but at the same time I'm thinking that these are either cutscenes from the actual story and he's getting angry or something and he gets involved in the fight and Vados is there to get involved in the fight and I think that this is a cutscene or these are the actual new moves now for us paid DLC players, we are going to be getting that new space pod you see there. We're going to get new super souls, new little emoji emotions or whatever. And we're going to get three sets of costumes. So one of those costumes being probably hits uniform, which would be dope as hell. I would turn my freaking Namekian character into a freaking hit. But the other two costumes now, who it's hard to think about who else is going to get uh give us like what what other costumes we're going to get. I think we're also going to get Monaka's costume. That would be pretty funny. I honestly think that. But any other costumes, I highly I don't I don't really want Vados's or Ch oh, Riss's clothes. I want Hit's clothes and Monaka's clothes because it's pretty funny. Something that people wanted in the first DLC too. Because it's, it's, it would be funny to have Monaka. Now, that is something else to think about too. Monaka as a free DLC. Uh, that'd be funny. Um, we're going to obviously get Champa and Vados. And we're going to get the new stage, Unnamed Planet, and of course the new story. Now, I don't know exactly what the story is going to hold and how long it is, you know. I don't know if it's anything like the previous game where they have their, you know, story. 
I was actually inter interesting and you know it actually doesn't just seem like something they just put in there because this is paid content so we want to get what we paid for we want it to be good like it looks all nice in there I just hope that it comes through now all you free DLC players out there who uh, who might may or may not be disappointed you never know they may just slip something in there like Monaka, Magetta, or Botamo for that matter for free DLC players or they might give a give a reskin of an, a character that's already in the game like Piccolo that's a possibility as well because Piccolo got that uh, I guess after image special beam cannon so you never know stay tuned guys this is just the beginning now remember this DLC is coming out in February. I'm predicting it might come out in the middle of February or on near Valentine's Day. But um, I'll see you guys later. And uh, I'll leave the link for V Jump Magazine down. Alright.